for you. Good morning, grade 10. We are now in the activity part of your um, module one, weeks one to four in the second quarter, right? Again, let me reiterate this one that upon checking on the first quarter, still your other classmates, right? Your other classmates didn't actually submit or attempted the um, activities. Again, um, my focus for this school year is for the grade 10. Remember that you will be an output at the school. Okay? Since you, you, will be, you will become an output at the school, you need to be competent enough. There's a need. Sure. Is that a need or a want? Okay? There, if you're going to ask me, it's a need. Okay, why? Because outside the school, after this, after this, you will be competing with the other schools, whether you like it or not. Okay? You'll be competing academically. You say academically with your academe, with your grades, okay, with your other subjects. And of course, I am helping you out. I am nurturing you with your skills. Okay. Apparently, um, talking about um, skills, if you're going to look at um, our activities, our activities is more on analytical skills. Have you ever, won ever wondered why? Why teacher MJ is always giving us this and that? That is for you to develop. Okay. And of course, do not give me a copy and pasted work. Okay. Uh, sometimes I actually observe that some of you um, had given me a copy pasted work. Why? Because I can always check on it simply because I created this module by my own. I know how um, the answers would be. And of course, I read a lot of articles. Okay? I handle different subjects before in senior high, junior high, and even college. That is why. So most probably, I know how these, these answers work. Okay, I know how these are actually composed. So again, my focus for this school year is for the grade 10 for you to be developed. Okay, I am helping you out. And if in case you're not helping yourself, I cannot do something about it. Right? Let me share it again. Okay, that's what I had observed. Right? That's what I had observed. Okay. For um, Science 10, let me check on some of the students. Okay. This is, I'm talking about uh, the first quarter grade, quarterly grade, right? Okay. I didn't actually see the work of Abalo on the module two, okay? Activity one to activity five. So how can I give this a grade? A lot of you didn't actually submitted a performance task, okay? Else. Yes, a lot of you didn't actually submitted a performance task. Why is that so? I can only see Okay, in the first performance tasks, module one, okay, performance tasks, we have Christian, Dimitri, Aluntaga, Holly, Cabradilla, Margie, MD. Okay, that's for the first. Uh, performance task. The second performance task, we have Holly, Margie, and MD. The rest didn't actually submit their performance tasks. Okay. Well, um, again, this is just for the first quarter, but do not be complacent. Okay. Even though this is um, the first quarter, 
I want you to internalize. I want you to think about this because first quarterly grade is part also of your whole year grade, okay, or your final grade. But you can always recover, right? So let's move now to your Q Q two weeks one to four, okay? Activity one. I'll be opening activity one for today since this is second quarter already, okay? I'll be opening the activity of the day and not I I will not open it again in the second day or in the second um, meeting. We need to move forward as much as we can simply because your um, mastery test is fast approaching, right? I already given you your coverage for the mastery tests, right? Again, what I want you to do now is activity one, okay? Which is identifying terminologies. Let me read the instructions given, okay? Identify the characteristics of each EM waves. Characteristics, meaning to say, meaning to say, it is not defining. It is what giving a characteristic, the characteristic of these waves. Okay. Type your answers in the space provided. What are the characteristic? Okay. How do this work? That's the characteristic. Right. Do you have any questions so far? Can I do it in like bulletin form, sir, or do I have to do it in sentences? You can do it in a paragraph form and you can do it also in a bulleted form. Okay, in a bulleted form, you will just highlight okay how this works or what are the characteristics of this. That's in a bulleted form. One good characteristic of bulleted form is you can highlight the characteristic itself. Okay. In a paragraph form, of course, you can always put it in a sentence, okay? put it in a paragraph form, and um, see to it that the characteristics are there, present in your paragraph. Okay. Again, do not give me a copy-pasted work because I can always double-check on that. Okay. I know um, the subject matter much. Right? Questions? Another question? Any How other it works, right, sir? Again, MD? How it works. Yeah. The characteristic and how it works. Okay? Because talking about um, EM waves, they actually work. But the question there is how. Like, for example, ultraviolet waves. How does these ultraviolet waves work? How? The question there is how? X-rays, how X-rays work? So in, the, in giving um, an illustration or giving a, 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 a how on a, a subject matter, especially in EM waves, you actually define the, or you're actually giving the characteristic of that certain EM waves, of course, right? Any other question? Any other question? Mm. All right. Answer. Yeah. I think that will be all for today, class. I'll be expecting answers from you. By the way, this um, activity will close this afternoon at 5 p.m. Okay, again, this uh -huh. activity will close this afternoon at 5 p.m. And take note that this is now second quarter. Okay, we need to strive hard. We need to... to um, give more emphasis on our subject. This is second quarter already. Second, third, and we have fourth. So this is again part of your final grade. Okay, your final grade, that is actually the, the average of the four quarters. That's your final grade. So whatever your grades from first quarter, second quarter, third quarter, and fourth quarter, you add it up or sum it up, Divided by four, that is your final grade, right? Mm -hmm. I think that'll do all for today, class. If you have questions, please um, give me a, a message or you just put it in our GC so that I can assist you with your concerns, right? I think that will be all. Yes. Again, I'm expecting answers from you until the end of the day. Have a nice day, grade 10. Take care. Bye-bye.
Thank you, sir. Okay. Thank you, sir.